up guys welcome 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 back to peanuts world once again this was a video filmed more than once i clearly do not want to film anymore so sorry if i'm <laughs> out of this um today we have peanut with us because he finally decided to wake up for a video <laughs> today we have a big big beep did i mention big <laughs> a big topic and today's topic is simply how to bathe your hamster you're gonna need a hamster and a sink. Just kidding, guys. Do not bring your hamster to your sink and do not turn on the water. Please, please, please. For your hamster's little life, don't do it. Don't do it. It's actually, um, in fact, the last time I filmed this video, he was doing the same thing, I swear. He's climbing through this light that I have. I know that sounds weird, but let me show you. It's this thing. And he likes climbing through it. He's really annoying me. So, anyway. It's actually really, really dangerous to bathe your hamster in water. So please, please, please do not put water or soap near your precious little baby. It's not the way to do it. You're risking your hamster's life and putting his life on the line. And it's just really, it's not worth it. Um, um, there's other ways... I'll show you a way to get them clean today, and um, it just leads to stress, wet tail, and um, it like strips their natural oils, which is not good. And if you are unfamiliar with what wet tail is, it, Victoria Rachel, I think, made a video on it, and Aaron's Animals, which they didn't tell me to say that, by the way. <laughs> um, but no, they're really good pet care channels. I would check them out for some stuff that you need to know. It's probably on those channels. Um... But anyhow, that explains what wet tail will be. <laughs> but what you're really going to need to bathe your hamster is a hamster. Was this not filming? Bro, I've been sitting here. Oh, God. It wasn't filming. No. Oh, wait. It was. I'm stupid. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I thought this wasn't filming. I thought it said two seconds, but it says two minutes. <laughs> but you're gonna need. He's so like spazzy right now. I'm sorry, guys. Like, I'm just gonna let him do his thing. Okay, you know what? You're gonna fall. Stop. Okay. You're gonna need children's play sand, is what I use, but you can use. I'm pretty sure you can use reptile sand. Uh, but for children play with sand, you really need to freeze it or cook it. Um, there's videos on what to do for that. A container, like a little plastic Tupperware, just to put your hamster in and um, so he can roll around the sand in. But the thing is, guys, some hamsters, like this one right here, this, this peanut, this peanut dude, he likes to use his sand bath for... Um, I'm just gonna let him go down his sand path for a potty which your hamsters might do that and your hamsters might not they might like rolling around in it i mean he also like oh geez what is he doing sorry guys um he also like um just kind of digs a hole in the sand and rubs his belly in it that's good too but um if your hamster is the one to use the bathroom in it you may or might not want it to like Put a second one in, and then maybe they'll roll around in one and use the bathroom in one. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> then that might help you guys. But if your hamster just doesn't want to use the bathroom, you're going to need a spare container and take them in there and bathe them with your hands. You're going to need to, like, put it in your fur and rub it and then stroke all the sand out and then put them back into their cage. So they might need a little assistance, but that's the way to do it. Also, that pretty much covers that topic. There's not much to really say except for the fact that you cannot bathe your hamster in water and only sand. He's going towards the camera and trying to knock you guys down. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. But before I go, I want to teach you guys a life hack. If you guys have a big hamster, like, for an example, Peanut, you guys might say, like, what? That's not big. Syrians are big, <laughs> that's the name, dwarf hamsters, and you guys don't want to go out and buy a tube, and you have this cardboard tube that you could have used perfectly fine for a dwarf, 
you can just take your scissors. I'm watching you, Peanut. You better not. No. No. You cannot go back there. Sorry, guys. He's being a really bad boy. Oh. Take it. No, you can't go in my candy jar, bro. Okay, take your scissors and cut a slit down the middle. Peanut, you're such a bad boy. I'm trying to film. And then you have something like this. And if he is willing to go through it. <laughs> Peanut is so wild right now. I don't think he likes the camera. Here, go. I'm not trying to like force him to go in there. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh no, I missed it, guys. He just went through the tube, though. Trust me, I would not lie about that, so then it makes it perfectly safe. Maybe he'll do it right now. Will you do it, Pina? Come on, go through it. Go through the tube. <gasps> he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to anymore. He only wanted to do it that one time. Pina, come on, I'm trying to show them. Well, he's trying to show chew my desk off <laughs> well anyway guys that kind of closes out this video thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video hit the thumbs up and if you didn't once again you can still hit the thumbs up <laughs> and um subscribe smash that notification bell so you get notified when i post here's what i want to talk about i'm gonna add on to this video i keep i kept saying sundays and mondays and i'm sorry i think i said that in my last video too but I meant to say, like, Wednesdays and Sundays. Wednesdays. No, sorry. Wednesdays and Saturdays. And those are my two days to post and upload. So on the video that said, like, Mondays and Sundays, it went up on Wednesday. That is why. I'm sorry. I apologize for that. Pina's getting antsy. <laughs> but that closes out this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. See you in the next one.